Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of J Bros Cooking and today I'm going to be making one of my favorites and that is steak and eggs. And this is a real, real simple recipe and you can do so much more with it, but I'm literally just gonna be making the steak and the egg. I guess it's more keto friendly. I don't really wanna get into the diet stuff because everyone has their own take on what is and what isn't, what you should do and what you shouldn't do. But uh, you can add so much to this. You can add veggies, you know, peppers and onions, potatoes. Today, I'm strictly just doing a steak and some eggs. I like um, T-bones and, you know, New York strip. This is all I could find is the top loin. And everything was wiped out. I searched and searched and this is the only cut I could find at my local grocery store. This is what I'm using, decent piece of meat. This is what I do, I'm just gonna hit a little olive oil on one side and kind of rub it on. Rub a little bit on the other side, just get it coated with that olive oil. I'm gonna hit this side real quick, try and get a little sear on the side. That fat right there. Mmm. I'm cooking this on a medium high. It's pretty much a high heat, not as high as you can go. Does that make sense? Put on its side. I'm just gonna hit it with some salt. And some pepper. It's supposed to grind it. This one doesn't really grind it that fine. Sometimes it's better if you use it more ground. It cooks more evenly. I don't know, some people don't like a, doesn't really matter to me. I usually cook them on the grill anyways, but I got this new pan for Christmas, so I'm giving it a try. All right, then I'm just gonna give it a quick flip. I'm gonna lower my temp down. I'm gonna throw some butter in. Get that going. And then I'm gonna use a thermometer. All right, so I'm just gonna pull my steak now. It's about 135 temp, that's what it's saying. My good thermometer broke, so we'll see what it actually says when we cut it open and pull that off. We're just gonna cook the eggs in this goodness right here. I'm just gonna cook two eggs. Mm. One. And two. Just hit them with a tad. Just a smidge. Sea salt, tiny bit of black pepper. All right, so now the eggs are done. Did them sunny side up. That seems to be the go-to uh, way for steak and eggs. Put them right there. A little juice from the steak. Mmm. Grab the other one. No yolks were broken in this experiment? Wow. My photographer, video editor, and producer is looking at this and saying, this needs some garlic rice. And if you want our recipe to garlic rice, I'll link it, or she'll link it. The big reveal, we gotta cut and see, see if I did any good. All right, well, there you have it. Steak and eggs. Mm, yummy. Yeah, like I said before, you're gonna add a bunch of stuff to this. Some bread, potatoes, whatever you want, really, veggies. I just wanted to do the steak and eggs today. Yeah, I'm gonna go in right away. Got a little juice here. Got a little egg action going on. Mm. That wraps up another episode of J Bros Cooking. Yes, this one was very simple. You know, if you gotta temp your steak, if you're not at that level yet, don't don't be scared. Just use a, use a thermometer. I'll leave a little picture in the video here of um, all the temps, whatever you like. Steaks start at like blue, which is pretty much raw. Then they have rare, which is still pretty much raw. Then they have medium, which is kind of like, if you're not medium, you're wrong, I guess. That's what all the like celebrity chefs say and you know, all the cooking channels. I don't really care how you do your steak, just to be honest. I grew up, you know, we weren't allowed to have anything besides well done. But as I got older, I realized um, that there are other ways to cook it. And I do like medium, medium's pretty good. Medium well's good for me. And I've had well done that's really good. I've had well done that's really burnt too. So I guess it just depends on how you like it really. Keep John your thoughts and prayers. We greatly appreciate it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check us out on social media, at jbroscooking, jbroscooking.com if you wanna download our recipe or check out our merch store. Remember, <laughs> 
It's always better when you make it yourself. J Bros out. All right, John, you want to try this one?